All right, now Samsung has started rolling out an all new update for its sharing feature called Quick Share. And in this video, we are going to take a look at that minor change. And I'm also going to tell you how the link sharing works within this Quick Share feature. That's kind of a hidden feature on Samsung Galaxy devices, which you guys should know. Now, first, let me show you the change log and the version number here. As you can see, the version is 13.3.01.8. And the change log says, change the color of the device icon and display guide when copying links. So what is this Quick Share? Whenever you share any files from your gallery or your files application, you get to see this icon right here at the bottom left corner. As you can see, we've got Quick Share here. You can also access Quick Share by going to settings and uh, tapping on this connected devices, you will see Quick Share menu right here on top. This is a nifty feature offered by Samsung on its Galaxy devices. Now let's go back to the sharing menu. As you can see, the icon of Quick Share has changed a bit. Now earlier, it was in a different color tone. Now it is matching with the One UI 5.0's icons. That's a minor change we have. Using this quick share feature, we'll be able to transfer small or big files very conveniently between Samsung Galaxy devices. When you have another Samsung Galaxy device next to your phone with quick share enabled, you will see the phone right here on top under share to nearby Galaxy devices option. All we need to do is tap on this icon to select that particular phone and instantly we'll be able to share the data. Most of us know this. Now moving on to the important part of this video, right below this option we have got something called copy link. Now if you want to share any file from your Galaxy phone to another Galaxy phone or a non-Galaxy phone could be any other Android phone and let's say that phone is not next to you. You may be sending it to somebody who is sitting far away or who is sitting in a different part of the world. Then all you can do is tap on this copy link option. As you can see, it says share to any device. Create a link that can be opened on any phone, computer or other device with a web browser. So what this does is it's going to upload the data to the Samsung Cloud Drive and create a link for you and the link can be shared with others through any messaging application or through an email or even through a QR code. Now with this all new update, this feature has been enhanced. Now let me just tap on this copy link option. As you can see, it's creating a link. And now we get to see a pop-up which says link copied. Paste the link in the app where you want to share it. In the previous version, we never got this kind of uh, pop-up. It was just saying link copied. That's another minor change or improvement we have got with this all new update. We get to see a pop-up as soon as the link is copied. Now, once the link is copied, you go to any application and share it. The other person, the receiver is going to click on that link to download that data. Now, there is definitely some caveat to this feature. Let me show you what is it all about. Let's go to settings. Let me tap on connected devices and I'll tap on quick share. Now here you see we have got a separate tab for share as link option, which is link sharing. Now here it shows link sharing history and there is a limit of maximum 5 GB which can be sent using Samsung's cloud. Now let me tap on this. As you can see, we have got all the link sharing history here received as well as sent history is right here. Again, we have got these many options at the bottom. We can copy the link again. We can share it in the app again. And you can also tap on this stop sharing link if you don't want to continue sharing the data through that link with the others. And another point to note here is the files which you share through link sharing will be available for just two days max. As you can see here on top, it says available until 6th November. Unfortunately, we don't have the option to extend the expiry date of a particular link. This is how link sharing feature works under quick share feature on Samsung Galaxy phones. And this minor update brings in an all new icon and a new pop-up to notify that the link has been created. Let me know whether you guys are using this feature or not. Drop a comment and while you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel. We just crossed 40k subscribers and we are aiming to hit 50k as soon as possible. So do support the channel and smash the subscribe button. And if you find this video informational, do hit the like button as well. Thanks a lot for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. My name is Salyan signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.